this beautiful river right here. Uh, today is going to be another big beetle day. So the Kintaria beetle is very active. We're going to throw these big... say that's just about a wrap for the video thing we've had a great day it's afternoon uh, I'd say at this point we're gonna just stop videoing just keep fishing chill out enjoy the rest of our float here uh, we'll fish a little bit but it'll probably be just when we find a fish but it's been a great day um, advice I have for you just kind of some concluding tips is uh, have a dry fly rod that you really like. I'm fishing a nine, my favorite nine foot five weight uh, sage and uh, just a scientific angler's amplitude infinity line. It loads up quick. There's there's a ton of direction changing. So like we're throwing between these logs like so. We might check this spot real quick, check that spot and be moving ahead in a fast action rod where you can quickly pick up a fly from here and shoot and change directions down there basically hopping from spot to spot to spot. Uh, is really important. So weight forward floating line, something that loads up quick. Uh, we're fishing nine foot, two X liters or one X, um, depending on on the guide, and the tippet, the, the, the conditions. Um, but basically just dry fly fishing, um, taking it along. But I would work on your casting, work on shooting line in a really quick tip oriented cast, just so that you can move a fly, move the fly about the river. Uh, as efficiently as possible. So I wish you the best of luck on your trip to Patagonia and uh, hopefully these tips help. We're going to float down and uh, go have a great dinner at the lodge, uh, see how the other anglers did and uh, just kind of soak it up. It's been a great day.